Namaste to you guys, my name is Seba and I help people awaken their consciousness. Today I want to speak about negative feelings, how to deal with your negative feelings and how to really learn to alchemize these negative feelings in order to be your best self, in order to be your best version. What I'm coming to realize is the fact that it's not easy. It's not easy and sometimes we go through thought patterns, sometimes we go through emotional disturbances, sometimes we go through rough moments. But what I'm coming to realize is the fact that all these negative feelings, all these negative moments are actually building you. So it's about getting stronger in the process. It's about really becoming your best version in the process, okay? So I realized that in order to deal with, neg with negative feelings, the first thing to do is to actually accept these negative feelings, okay? It's about acceptance. The more that you accept the negative feeling and the more that you relax into it, is the more that you actually begin to dissolve it, okay? So accept your negative feelings. This is the first tool, accept, accept, accept. What I'm coming to realize about negative feelings is the fact that we are being out of vibrational alignment when we are experiencing a negative feeling, okay? Vibrational alignment means staying connected to your source, staying connected to your pure authentic self. The second tool to realize in alchemizing negative feelings is the fact that you gotta step back into vibrational alignment. You gotta connect back to your own source again, you gotta connect back to your true self again. You gotta actually be the champion that you are, okay? So, the second tip is connect back into your vibrational aligned state. How do we do this? Well, we step into the heart space and we listen to our intuition. The intuition always speaks to us and whenever we are not listening to our intuition, we are creating blockages, okay? We are creating emotional blockages and mental blockages. The more that we learn to accept these things is the more that we learn to also transcend these things, okay? The third thing I'm realizing in having to alchemize negative feelings is a neutral state of consciousness, okay? It's not always about, po about positivity, it's more likely about accepting the both sides of the coin, okay? There is no good or evil, there is only energy. The moment that you see yourself as neutral is the moment that you actually accept yourself unconditionally, okay? So realize that there is no good or bad externally, it is only how we choose to make it, okay? So how do you make your experiences? Because you can actually turn negative experiences in your favor the moment that you actually shift your perception and the moment that you actually shift your belief system, okay? So it's about keeping a neutral state of consciousness. So accept yourself, vibrational alignment and keeping a neutral state of consciousness. These are all tools for you to, for you to actually alchemize negative feelings, okay? I realized that yes, sometimes we go through fear, sometimes we go through low vibrational states of consciousness, sometimes we go through addiction. What I'm also coming to realize is the fact that self-responsibility is necessary if you want to actually heal these low vibrational states of consciousness. So the fourth tip is self-responsibility. How responsible are you today? What are the things that you are actually expressing out there today? What are the things that you are actually doing today for you to actually become your best version? Okay, so self-responsibility is the fourth tip. Be responsible and be yourself in the process because it's all that it takes for you to actually dissolve negative feelings, okay? I realized that the negative feelings have the power to wound us and negative feelings have the power to create trauma within our vibrational body. They have the power to create trauma in our auric field. But what I'm also coming to realize is the fact that we actually need negative feelings okay we need to actually celebrate these negative feelings okay so we need negative feelings in order to learn what the positive is the fifth tip is celebrate everything the moment that you actually celebrate everything the moment that you celebrate your pain the moment that you celebrate your trauma the moment that you celebrate your failure is the moment that you actually get to act to alchemize these things, okay? So celebrate, 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 celebrate everything and realize that there is truth within yourself, there is abundance within yourself. The more that you look within yourself for answers is the more that you get to actually alchemize yourself in the process, okay? So the fifth tip is celebrate everything. Now the last tip is realize that it's not always about staying happy. 
okay even if that is our is it, even if that is actually our natural state of consciousness is not always about being happy it's more likely about learning to accept yourself unconditionally okay accept yourself unconditionally and see what happens because if you accept yourself no matter what then you cannot go wrong if you love yourself no matter what then you cannot go wrong okay guys so yeah this was today's message these are my six tips in order for you to actually shift negative feelings into positive feelings realize that it's all it's okay to not be okay sometimes it's okay to not be okay learn to get actually stronger in the process by accepting yourself turning into vibrational alignment keeping a neutral state of consciousness celebrate everything and so on okay so realize that you are meant to actually thrive in this life you are meant to actually alchemize yourself unconditionally you are meant to be your own master in the process okay guys so this was today's message about learning to alchemize negative feelings realize that it's all happening for you and yes sometimes the tears feel good okay the failure feels good sometimes but in essence there is no failure because we either win or we learn in the process okay so guys thank you for watching this was today's message if you are new to my youtube channel feel free to subscribe and leave a comment if you want to work with me personally on a one-on-one -on -one level feel free to send me a message and if you want to be part of my spiritual podcast called consciously awakening feel free to also send me a message guys thank you for watching namaste to you and see you on what is coming up next yeah let's actually begin to alchemize our negative feelings into more positive ones because we deserve to be happy we deserve to be complete we deserve to be our best versions much peace and see you on what is coming up next namaste to you i love you so much with my heart with my soul ciao guys